Hey guys, it's Di, and I wanted to share my sale haul from the VIB Sephora sale part one. And this is part one because I just stopped into the store real quickly the other day to grab a few things. And obviously when I have the kids with me, I don't have a ton of time, so I grabbed a few things I knew was on my list, and I'm going to be putting in part two of my order over the weekend online. And um, don't get too excited about the huge bag because there's not that many things in here. It's just a few things that are very large. So that's how I ended up with the big bag. But I did end up going to the Oakbrook Sephora and they've changed to a new location. And I love the new store. There are no more stairs in the store, which is awesome if you have kids or need a handicapped accessible type of store. And I really like the new setup and the ladies there were awesome and lots of help. So um, definitely loving the Oakbrook store a lot more <laughs> and so I um, will show you real quickly what I got from the VIB sale and they had a VIB event on Thursday which is the day that I stopped in so I did get a few um, specific things just to the VIB sale which I wanted to show you guys first of all Oakbrook Sephora had these cute little waters that they gave me. It says, you're a star, Sephora Oprah loves VIBs. I thought that was super nice of them because they could tell I was stressed out shopping with the kids. <laughs> so they gave me waters. And then the main thing that I knew I wanted to get and I was happy that they had in the store was this little perfume set. They actually had these cute little snowflake flower things. My daughter was calling them flowers, but they're actually snowflakes on a lot of the items in the store, and especially all the perfume things had them. I got this Sephora Favorites, the Captivators little perfume sample. And the Captivator set has the Dior Addict to Life, the Juicy Couture Viva La Juicy, the Michael Kors, Michael Kors fragrance and Versace yellow diamond and the reason why I got this was because it was $42 which was a really excellent value. I like that they have a lot of these perfume sets out this year. I usually try to get one of these every year during the VIB sale because it's such a great deal especially with the additional 20% off and then these are the type of sets where you can bring a card back in and get a full size perfume which I actually went ahead and did that day. I knew that I already wanted the Dior scent and I may actually get, a, get one more of these they have a set that has the Prada candy scent in it this year, and so I may actually get one of those sets during the sale as well, and I will be content for perfume for a while. So I got the 1.7 fluid ounce Dior perfume that goes with this, so I already used my little card that came in this. And it's actually a really great deal because this was $42 plus my 20% off, and then this regular price was like $69. So I ended up getting almost a $70 perfume for like 30 something dollars. So that's a really good deal. So if you guys have the VIB percent off, you should definitely think about getting perfume. It's a really great deal. And then the only other thing that I got when I was in there was the Makeup Forever HD foundation. I was almost out of this. I've been using this so much the past few months. This is the 110 foundation and this is a really great color for me for winter and I find it also works really great with the Beauty Blender sponges. And then this is the little tote that they were giving away for the VIBs as a part of the event. Oh, I also got this NARS set. It was a 500 point set. I decided to go ahead and get it because I really like these cute little pouch sets by NARS. And it had a few different things in it. I think they just released this for the VIB event and then it's also available online. But it has that primer that I've been liking using so I went ahead and got this set to get another one of these primers. This is the NARS Pro Prime eyeshadow base. It also has a velvet gloss lip pencil and the color is New Lover. It's a really pretty, ooh, it's really pretty, it's a really pretty pink color and I actually like this a lot more than I thought I was going to. That's a really pretty pink color so I like that. I'm really glad I got this now. <laughs> And then it also came with these two little things. It has the Pro Prime Pore Refining Primer, so I thought that would be good to try out the primer. And then also this uh, little mini orgasm blush. And that would be really great for purse. And it has a mirror on the top of it. So all in all, that was a cute set. It was only 500 points, so I went ahead and got that. And then this bag didn't really have that much down inside of it. I had a Sephora catalog for winter and coincidentally the day that I got my VIB card in the mail I also got a really nice big glossy Sephora catalog which I don't have upstairs to show you but it's a really nice catalog very durable. I also got the Tiffany catalog that day. It was a good catalog day. 
And then this just came with a few samples down on the inside. There's no deluxe samples or anything, so it's just kind of basic samples. Not quite as good as the last VIB kit. But this has the a more Pacific Moisture Bound, a Lacoste Perfume, and a Clean Skin Perfume, a Sephora Cinderella Promotional thing. No samples there. It's got a sample of the Carol's Daughter Menoir sulfate-free shampoo and conditioner, so I like trying that because I like trying different shampoos and conditioners. An Origins High Potency Night Amends Mineral Enriched Renewal Cream little sample. A Hydro Life BB Cream by Dior. I actually I been wanting to try that, so that's good. And an Allergenist Concentrated Reconstructing Serum. So they're just all little tiny samples. There's no like real big deluxe samples like there was in that bag, but the tote is actually very nice this year. I like this tote and I would actually use this. So it's definitely worth stopping in to get this VIB tote and I think it's really cute. So that was everything from my kind of mini haul from the VIB sale. And like I said, I'm going to be doing the rest of my shopping online because it's easier for me just to shop when my kids are asleep and down for the evening and I can sit there and kind of play around with my card and make my decisions. But I was glad to stop in and see this set in person and I'm definitely glad I went with it. I didn't even actually smell any of the other fragrances because I knew I wanted to get this Dior one. But these little mini deluxe samples are really, really cute. And I think that these would actually be a great gift as well. And this scent is very, like, it's sophisticated and maybe kind of more a springy summer scent. But I liked it so much that I decided to go ahead and get it. I don't want to get it everywhere, so I won't even open it. So that is everything from the Sephora haul. And I will go ahead and do my Sephora haul part two from the VIB sale after I get my online order in. But the sale is going on right now, November 8th through 12th for VIBs. You should have gotten a card to your mail or email, and the code online is CELEBRATE. And if you are not a VIB, I do have one promotional code, which I have offered up to my circle of friends, but they already got the VIB promotion. So the first person to send me a message through YouTube can go ahead and get that code. You just have to be a Beauty Insider. You don't have to be a VIB. And I do have one unique code that I will go ahead and send to the first person that messages me at YouTube. It's good through the 12th, so you need to send me a message before then, and you can use it online. And you unfortunately won't be able to use it in the store, I don't think, because you'd actually have to present them the card, and there's not enough time for me to mail it to you. So, if anyone would like that, go ahead and send me a message. I will post a big message over this if it's already been given out to someone. And hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.